Welcome to my GTA Full Immersion Series Part 1. Today we focus on car handling and in the next parts we add more realistic mods to GTA 5. A little info right now. I modded my GTA single player. Never use this tutorial to mod your GTA online. Rockstar will ban you. By the way, some mods in this series can make missions impossible. So better use it to explore and free roam. First of all, you need to install GTA 5. Better start with a clean install to reduce bugs to a minimum. After that, download the handling mod Realistic Driving V, version 1.1 at the moment, and open IV. Links also in description. Step 1. Create a backup of your update RPF. You can find it in your GTA folder slash update. Step 2. Launch open IV. Go to Tools RC Manager and activate the RC Loader for editing the RPF files. Step 3. In OpenIV go to your GTL folder update update.rpf common data and activate the edit mode. Choose the handling file you want. I go with all DLCs because I have them installed and with increased deformation. Be careful with that. Cars break down really easy with this. But we want realistic driving? So not here for an air kart racer, are we? Step 5. Just drag and drop the handling meter in the folder and close open IV. You don't need to save this. Now we have realistic driving in all situations. Acceleration, corners, braking and crashing. Realistic as fuck, just like we wanted. And if you want to delete this mod, just replace the modded RPF with your backup file. Thanks for watching, see ya next time.